Marlon. I like making hand pieces, little people, little things, small minded. <laughs> Just doing an owl at the moment. The dog out of the mould, uh, or the body, body was out of the mould, and the head hand built, the owl's hand built, of course. So just covering him in prior to firing. My name is Barbara, and learning from other people. And this is my newest project, my chicken here. And I'm doing fruits, like plates, white plates with strawberries and roosters and turtles and um, all sorts of pots. Uh, my name is Irene Foley. Um, I've been on the island five years and I've been pot doing pottery for four years. Um, I also do art. Um, at the moment I'm working on a large mushroom and this is the top of it. Um, I've actually done three of them, so I usually do a lot of things um, handmade and make them fairly big, like big pots and big cats and things like that. So it's your fish that I've just finished waiting to be fired. This is the base for the mushroom that um, I've made and I've done three different sizes in this and uh, I'll be able to put garden lights in them. <laughs> I was telling Roy and Roy said, is it worth saving? I said, no, but we're not throwing it out, Roy, until it comes out this time. Exactly. <laughs> this kiln is actually filmed uh, full with glazed pottery and this is the last fire for this work and then it'll go into the gallery. A Velda. Velda and Velda, what do you actually do? Um, all sorts of things. Art and pottery. Um, yeah, so I did uh, the three wise men in in um, the Ellis, yes. uh, which was sold at the exhibition, but somebody else wanted more. The kid. Okay. <laughs> Um, there's one here, this, this is not mine, but it's a really nice one to do. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So Marilyn, what, what caused you to paint this in the first place? What was it that... Honouring the best time of a woman's life. It's from a model that I had posed and, and she did a beautiful job considering that she was about, what, seven and a half months pregnant. Art form? I wouldn't be alive without it. As that. Yes, that's beautiful. Yeah. And that's why I like to encourage people, if you have a passion and at this stage in your life particularly, Go for it. Uh, and I'm on it. it. Yeah. My roses yeah. are a dunning oil, and I oh, learned to paint oh, about 35 yeah. years ago okay. as a china painter. Oh, and I've done this with oil rather than acrylic, and find that I can take the method I learned through china painting into oil much easier than acrylic. This is. Sculpted from wild hibiscus, a small tree that grows on the shoreline. And when you see it growing, it's very, very rough and coarse looking bark. And when you get inside, you look at the beautiful grains and the colour. It's, 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 it's just spectacular. There's very, very few things made from it because, of course, you can't harvest it. You have to rely on 
pieces of time by chance. This is a, um, a reproduction of a photo of Franz Kafka, author of the trial, who lived in Prague. Okay. Bob Brownsy. Okay, it's just a story of electric starting off from Edison with his light bulb. Then we go on to power lines. Then we go on to this most important one, in my opinion, proved by engineering. Um, formula. This is a cooked up and it could create problems which the researchers have found like through phones they change the cells. Thank you.